The Lagos State Community Development Advisory Council has praised Governor Babajide Sonwulu for his efforts towards ensuring development gets to communities in the state. The body, which is made up of leaders across community development associations and community development committees in the state, said this on Tuesday, 10th November 2020, during the annual leadership training organized by the State Ministry of Local Government and Community Affairs. We need ourselves to fight that from We need ourselves. See my daughter will move to the Korea team. Then you will go the training was specifically organized to improve the efficiency of community leaders who were newly elected into the Lagos State Community Development Advisory Council with the task of ensuring rapid development across the nooks and crannies of the state. The theme of this year's training was probity, transparency and accountability, a panacea for good community leadership. We need ourselves. We need to make impact in the community. Speaking at the program, the first guest speaker, Honorable Doyin Johnson, a reputable public affairs analyst, explained the essence of good community leaders and how it can stimulate development in the community. He emphasized on the need for community leaders to bridge the communication gap between them and the community, irrespective of their tribe, sociocultural, or religious dispositions. Wisdom, and also speaking at the training was an astute administrator and veteran community developer, Al Aji Bidinola Idowu. He gave a description of what community leadership entails and how the principle of probity, transparency, and accountability can be adopted to achieve good community leadership in the state. We are going to talk about leadership as this. What? Some are concrete. Some achieve greatness and some greatness are important in the right here. What be and where you live? Speaking on behalf of the organizers, Mrs. Olubukola Ogumbao said the program was meant to train community leaders in the state as they are considered to be prominent agents and partners in the building of a greater Lagos. Let me use the opportunity to thank um, Mr. Governor for being so magnanimous to approve this year 2020 leadership training. It's really a, an, an annual thing that we've been having since I joined the service. But this year when it's coming at a time when the economy is going through a lot of trouble, coming out of coronavirus pandemic and the issue of NSAS came up, Lagos State has gone through a lot and despite that, Mr. Governor still find it necessary for us to train our newly elected community leaders so as to assist and be partners in the building up of Lagos State. As it were. She heard the participants at the training to take the lessons learned to the people of their respective communities. Giving their remarks after the intensive training, Participants commended Governor Sonwulu for organizing the training, which they said has further equipped them. They highlighted knowledge gained at the training, stating how they would ensure its implementation in their communities. This is, I can say this is the second time I attended some, uh, a program like this. I learned so many things from it, and which we, were, we have been doing in our own community. And so the training has given us more light as enlightening us more on a handle and handle community. We have to go home and uh, impact the same knowledge into our followers there so that they can have effect on them. So that's what we do. We get home, we call a meeting and we do the same at home. So that the CDC on the CDC level they can do the same thing at the CDA level. Impact that knowledge. I think that's what we're supposed to do now. We shouldn't keep it to us. We should disseminate to the community people. Governor Olu Sholababa Jide is a man of the people. And I pray that all his hand and inspiration, God will lead him to accomplish it in this state. In respect of the COVID-19 and the answers, he still approved that we should have this type of election. As a kudos to him. May God continue to assist and help him.
Governor Babajide Sonwolu is somebody that I have so much, so much respect for. He has been doing so well with us. He has been communicating with us, and he has been making sure and assuring us that whatever we need as community leaders is ready to do it for us. Governor has done a lot of things. He's a man who has been able to give much to the state, most especially during the crisis. I'm talking right from the pandemic, COVID-19 time, till lately and SARS. Let's thank God that God gave us somebody like Sonwolu as a governor of Lagos, which I believe by next year, we are going to witness a real total transformation in Lagos than what we have witnessed in the past. I want to thank our governor for granting us this opportunity, for giving us this opportunity of this training. He granted that training at a time when the economy of the state is not too good. If the governor can do that much for us, we appreciate him and our feelings. And my own conclusion is that to whom much is given, much is respected. That's the more reason why our people must strive to make sure that they do those things that are right at all times, to see that the communities are in, in peaceful condition, to justify what the government has spent on us.